Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are vlogging if you cannot tell already. I'm currently waiting for my car to defrost because I am going to the gym. We are gonna be hitting triceps and chest today. I'm just waiting for my front windshield to defrost. My back already is defrosted. Also, I got my new car. I haven't shown you guys yet. I got a um, Chevy Cruze. I'll show you guys the outside. This is her all icy because she is frozen on the front. The inside is like all dark leather interior. It's really nice. I got super, super lucky with finding it. I honestly like don't know how I lucked out with this car. Like I got extremely lucky with finding it. Finally out of the rental truck. If you are new around here, I got into an accident about a month ago and I've been in a rental for a month. It has been literally awful trying to find a new car, like just with how the market is right now. Been really difficult to find a car, so I got very blessed with finding this car. I think that's really all I have to say so far. I just wanted to say hello, welcome to the vlog, and let's head on into the gym. I just made it to the gym. Like I said, I'm hitting triceps and chest today, and I am so sore from my workout yesterday. I did hamstrings and glutes yesterday, and I believe it is on the video before this because yesterday's vlog was like super last minute. So pretty sure that is on the video before this, my glutes and hamstrings workout. If you guys want to check that out, I would love to do um, a like workout with me video and show you just different workouts for different muscle groups that i like to do let me know kind of what you guys want to see like in that aspect like of fitness i think we're gonna head on in go to like a really small like family-owned gym in my hometown so if there's like four people in here it sucks because like everything's taken and i probably won't be able to record because i think i know who's in there and it's just gonna be awkward if i'm recording myself so i will talk to you guys after my workout all right y'all it is a little bit later i've done nothing interesting i did my workout went home made a quick egg sandwich and changed and i am about to leave for a hair appointment this sweatshirt or whatever you want to call it is from freaking walmart i'm not even kidding you guys walmart has cute stuff I have really cute jeans from there too and I was looking at their sweaters and stuff like Walmart has freaking stepped up their clothing game like do not sleep on them for clothes because they are cute they are affordable freaking awesome I love Walmart leaving a little bit early because I want to swing through Starbucks and the Starbucks I'm going to is super hit and miss hit or miss on whether they are busy or not so I don't know if I'm about to wait in the drive through for 20 minutes or fly on through so i'm leaving a little bit early just to make sure i have time because i don't want to be late i am going to christina that i always go to her instagram is ordinary artistry i will leave it linked down below and show you guys some of her work she is phenomenal if you guys live in indiana she is in the richmond area so um eastern side of indiana so i highly recommend going to her she specializes in blondes i think technically but my mom has dark hair and goes to her as well and she does really good on brunettes too she does phenomenal blonde hair i've gone to her since she's been out of hair school and i don't really know how long it's been a couple years be sure to check her out i'm gonna go ahead and drive over to her and i will talk to you guys probably in the starbucks drive through and update you guys on that situation all right i don't know how well this is gonna stay here there's a person behind me oops there you go there's like no good place to mount you. That might stay in the drive-thru. Like it would, I like popped my thumb to catch the camera. That clip was chaotic. I'm here at Starbucks and it's not super busy, but like I'm the fourth car in line. So I don't know how long this one took. Christina never texted me back that she wanted anything, but I am really hoping that meant no, she does not want anything. Did I just hit the curb? I don't think I did. My video went live an hour and a half ago and I still have not posted a link to it or anything on any of my stories. I usually um, share my videos on Instagram and Snapchat. I'm really slacking on my story today. That's fine though. I'm gonna go ahead and get my coffee and head on over to Christina. It's 5.30. There you go. Thank you so much. Have a good day. Anyway. I just made it to the salon. This angle's really odd because 
I thought I could pick a spot with decent lighting and like no spot has good lighting right now because of where like the sun is positioned and how this car lot is laid out. And I have my pumpkin cream cold brew. And I wish Starbucks would keep it year round like because I would drink pumpkin year round. Like I don't care if it's like technically a seasonal flavor but like it's good year round. I am just waiting to go in. It is 11.48 and my appointment is at noon. I might head in here in a minute because I need to pee before she starts doing my hair because my hair takes like two, two and a half, three hours to do just because I have so much hair. All right, this, ah, the lighting here is so bad. Um, I just got out of the salon. I will show you guys better when I get home, obviously, because you can't really see it because of the lighting, but looks so good. I love it. Once again, I will leave her Instagram and stuff linked down below so you guys can check her out if you are in the Indiana area. I think I'm just going to drive home. I'll show you guys a better look at my hair when I get there, obviously, because this lighting is garbage. Okay, so I'm at home with better lighting where you can see it better looks so good she always does me good i think i'm gonna get ready and take some pictures i don't really know how or where i'm gonna take pictures yet because i don't really have anyone to help me take my pictures so not really sure what we are gonna do but i'm gonna go inside and put on a quick face of makeup and grab a snack because it is 3 30 and i had like a later breakfast before i went up but i have not had lunch and i'm starving back of my car because this is where I took pictures and I wanted to do like the type of picture where like it looks like you're taking it from the passenger seat but like I can't really there's nowhere to prop my phone for it I don't have someone to help me take pictures so I was riding the struggle bus and I just posted normal selfies and I hate posting just like a normal selfie because I feel like everyone does that and if you go on like influencers or bloggers instagrams like, they don't post, like, front camera selfies like someone takes their picture. If you take your own pictures and have any tips, please let me know because I hate my Instagram because I just feel like it looks like anyone else's Instagram. I don't really have anything else to do right now, so I might make some TikToks or something. I don't really know. Mom and I might be going to, um... Pio later, which if you've never heard of that, it's Pilates and yoga combined. Um, there's a girl here that does those kinds of classes. And we used to go over winter when I was home for winter break last year. Um, I think we're going to go tonight. I can't. She never told me if they're having it tonight or not. That's what we were waiting on to hear if they're even having it tonight since it's the week of Thanksgiving. But we might be going to that later. All right, you guys. It's been a hot second. Um, I went over to one of my cousins. I didn't move the piano. I watched other people move a piano, and I was just along for the ride and to sit and chat. Casual Tuesday night activities. And now I'm going to Pio. And um, I won't be able to record in there just because there's, like, it's like a small group thing. So it would be, like, kind of weird if I recorded myself. I promise I am at a stop sign. But look how pretty the sky is. It doesn't, like, it looks really small on camera, but I swear it's prettier in person. Alright, this tripod is not being my friend today. I really need to buy a new one, but, um, just got back from Pio a little bit ago and had some dinner. I'm gonna light a candle and clean my room because, like, my stuff is just everywhere, really. This candle I'm gonna light is so good by dw home these are at tj maxx um it's my absolute favorite candle brand literally of all time like i will buy these before i will buy like a bath and body works one the scent is pumpkin spice latte so good highly recommend dw home have really good ones except sorry it just like snap crackle popped i was there the other day and they had one called mac and cheese and i was looking at it and i was like I love DW Home Candles, like, I don't know what it's going to smell like, but I'm going to smell it because usually I love them. 
it was the worst like canned cheese rotten smelling candle i wrote threw up in the aisle whoever came up with that deserves like jail time for that i don't freaking know but disgusting any other candle by them i would highly recommend do not smell mac and cheese they even have one that's like mashed potatoes and it doesn't smell bad it doesn't smell like mashed potatoes like i don't know what it smells like but it smelled fine anyways we're gonna pick up my room i want to show you guys these boots i ordered they are the iconic chinese laundry white booties how freaking cute are they I've been wanting a pair of white booties for forever and I've been trying to find the pair like at Target or something But they are always sold out and so I finally just got the Chinese laundry ones I wore those for a shoe I did with a boutique and They are the comfiest booties I've ever worn like I probably could have like ran a mile in them if I could run a mile So good. So if you're looking for a good pair of white booties I just feel like nowadays like they're so trendy and like such a staple piece for your closet they go with so many different outfits so if you're looking for a good pair check out chinese laundry because they have really good ones i'm gonna go ahead and get this monstrosity picked up it looks super messy just because like all my school stuff is home with me i have a big suitcase in my room and my room is like really small like I don't know what the square footage is actually but it's really tiny just believe me put a suitcase and a backpack in here and it's like takes up the whole floor so and I have clothes that I am taking to Play-Dohs. And then, so that's on my floor as well. We're gonna go ahead and pick up my room and I will talk to you guys after. Look who came to hang out with me. Winnie! Mwah. Oh, thank you. <laughs> no more. No more. Ah! Okay. All right, y'all. So my room is pretty much as clean as it's going to get while I'm here. So I think I am going to go ahead and end the vlog here, take a shower and go to bed. So thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up so that I know. Leave a comment down below and subscribe. And I will see you all in my next video. Mm -hmm.